Okay, so today what we'll be building is a Lego planter. So you're going to need to take this one by that's why I made project backwards and a site with GoDaddy. How will you make your mark? Make the world you want. 12 by 6. You'll need a 12 by 6 to start off. So, those are all the other parts you'll need. So then, and that one. So then what you'll do is you take any kind of these, I'm just using this because I just find whatever pieces I can and use them. So, now that you got that on there, add that one, and then just continue doing that all the way around. I use this one so it's easier for me, it doesn't have to have any holes in it though. So you put it like that, and we got that. Okay. Need one of these. You need another one of these four by one um plate things. So you pop that in, and it should look like this. And just so you know, it can be any color. Any size plate that you're using, like for instance, if you were to use this one, it'd be a bit smaller of a planter. So now that you've got that built, got that, and then you can grab a four by six um, plate. And then what you do is you have that and you put it on there just like that. And then you can grab these two and put them on there and then they should connect if you have the right kind. Or you could use any other kind of brick that you would like as long as it connects. And then you would put that on top just like that. And then put that to the side for now. And now that you have that, you put you can actually just go ahead and put it on so it'll be like that. Right? But before I forget, you actually have to add either a two by one two one by ones or you can do a four by two I mean a four by one which is what I'm using and then you put that on just like that you come over and then you can do that and add that one and then if you want to you can just go ahead and close it all off but, what I like to do is maybe just, if you would like, you can just go ahead and continue with those. I'm not going to, but what I am going to do is grab these parts and put them like that. It's okay if they are out a bit, but that's just the pieces I already had out. Now that you've finished that, flip the assembly over. Grab your little ball hitch and put it on like that, or you can just do um, a brick like this and that, and that will work just as well. That will work the same. I just think that to me it looks better when I do it like this. So that's what I'm going to do. And then, now that you finish that, it's okay if it falls off, you can go, you can go back and strengthen it, which is what I will do. 
right now. So you can use a 2x4, anything, depending on what size you want your planter and your seed cap to, er, capacity to be. You, If you can't get it on without lifting that up, you can lift it up. Flip the assembly back over and grab one of these... Um, wheels and just in one of these or any kind and just put it in there and just put it anywhere on here. I like to put it in the middle because to me that just makes more sense. So once that's on there, you can just do it on both sides like I did. And then there you go. You have that. And remember to wash your hands.